Hey guys, so if you saw that previous, the newest video that I put out on this channel, you would have seen that I had a ton of Dubernardia larva. Well, I have some bad news, but also some good news. Every, here's the bad news. Every single one of them died. Here's the good news, except this one. And the good news about it is, it's going to the second instar. It is currently shedding its skin. So that means, so that means we actually have a chance at raising these guys. All the other ones, I think, perished to disease. I think, I don't really think it was anything I did. I think because it, it was a lot of diseased ones just randomly dying. I just wake up, they'd be eating, and then they just fall to the ground and die. I think, I think it was just disease. But this one, this one is surviving. So I'm going to keep you guys regularly updated on it. This is going to be like a many, many, many Life of a Moth video. Just going to be like a few, just checking up on it every now and then. And um, keeping it, you know, good and well. And then we'll show the uh, adult at the end. I really do hope it is a male. Speaking of males. First Actia sinensis cocoon. And the pupa in there is a male. We have our other Actia sinensis in here. I'll take them out. There we go. That's the other one. I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna go get some food, new food, and uh, I'll do that. And yeah, every single Luna has made a cocoon. Here's the most recently pupated one. So yeah, I'll just keep y'all regularly updated on that Dubernardi, and uh, see you later.